Jersey Sports Zone's 2023 Camp Countdown Series is brought to you by RWJ Barnabas Health. After one of the most successful seasons in program history, Passaic Tech still feels like there's plenty of room to improve as they embark on the 2023 season. We have to get a little better than we did last year. We left a lot of points on the field, played some great teams. Our schedule is incredible. PCTI rode their top notch defense to a sectional title and was the North Jersey representative in the first ever Group 5 state championship game. The Bulldogs ultimately fell to Tom River North in the final. That loss has provided this year's mantra. Our motto this year is we have to finish. Uh, we have to finish drives, we have to finish tackles, finish series. Well, overall, it's just about finishing this year. You know, we finished pretty well last year, but we fell short against Tom River. So overall this year, we got a lot of hungry guys coming back. We got a lot of depth on this team. Passaic Tech enters the season with one of the most complete public school rosters in the state. It all starts with the Die Twins, Trayshawn and Trayvon. Trayvon is the bruiser and muscle at the fullback position and on the D-line, while Trayshawn racked up over 1,200 rushing yards and 138 tackles as a two-way menace. These two Syracuse commits will set the tone. Well, overall, we're, we're going to work hard regardless, and this year, more importantly, it's about getting other guys involved. So we took a lot of guys this year. We trained with a lot of guys, and that's what it's really about. This, this is going to be a team year. A lot of guys are going to show, show New Jersey what they're really about. The Bulldogs turned to quarterback Mikhail Taylor late in the year, and he was under center for their deep playoff run. He's worked this offseason as the incumbent starter. Two talented returning targets have made things easy. Big body Jovan Tyrell is a physical wideout, while Kashmir Jones brings shiftiness and agility to the gridiron. Yes, for sure, for sure. We all have been practicing each other, working hard every day, doing what we got to do. For sure, it has potential. PCTI's defense allowed just under nine points per game last season, and that unit will have to be great again. Lenape and Union City are two monster games to open the year. You can also circle September 14th against West Orange and October 19th against Patterson Eastside as must-see TV. The Bulldogs are working to make sure they're still standing at the end of the year. Um, I'm pretty sure around New Jersey and North Jersey, a lot of guys are saying that we have the potential to be that team, but within the locker room, within on the field, I think that these guys just want to get better every single week, and we're going to put the work in to do it. That's the most important about this team. Everybody come together, and we're all a family. You can be great players, but if you're not a great leader at this point in your senior year, your teams don't do as well. So we just, again, we have to keep on building through them. Reporting for Jersey Sports Zone, I'm Jay Cook.